bringing you the next best thing, the next best cracker that you're ever going to eat. Yeah, you like the way that cracker crunches? Well, this one has wheels. Welcome, you are now in a new car commercial. Yes, this car commercial makes no fucking sense, right? Well, Ooh, that's, that's what we fucking... like to do here at Fletcher's Car Motors. I'm we like to make no sense cracker? with the commercials we're bringing you. Yeah, we're talking to you. Doesn't matter okay. what you're eating. We love, we love um, the fact what? that you're just eating crackers. It makes the commercial make eat, no sense cr whatsoever. What does that have to do okay? with cars? Yeah, makes no sense. All right, we'll talk to you later. Hey, we'll Nothing. hear a call back from you soon. All okay. right, goodbye. What is going on YouTube? It is your boy Juicebox here. Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I want to talk to you guys a little bit about something that has been popping up on TV recently. A lot of stuff just been popping up. Um, car commercials. Uh, so, if you guys didn't know, there's always those little cars that you know that are like driving around and you see them on the road. If you guys don't know what cars are, then you guys are either infants or just you aren't born yet and you're watching this video. Um, so a lot of car companies have a lot of great car commercials, okay? My favorite car at this point in time is a Tesla. And I have never watched a Tesla commercial and I feel like it's, it's very weird. Um, another thing that it bothers me is that sometimes car commercials don't even have a fucking point. And it, it gets us so frustrated, it gets me frustrated, like, because I'll sit there and I'm like, oh, it's a commercial for, like, oh, health insurance probably, because you're talking about, you know, you know, people's, you know, illnesses, blah, blah, Toyota introducing the new Prius. And I'm like, what the, f what the fuck, what does this have to do with anything? This makes no sense. It's a car commercial, but yeah, we're talking about people being sick. This makes no sense. But that's what they like to do. That's what gets us to watch it, you know? That's their hook. And, I mean, just me getting frustrated, they're obviously, they're obviously, like, sitting there at their desk like, this person obviously fell for a trick. And it's like, okay, I mean, I get it. Um, you know, it's, it's basically clickbait. It's their form of clickbait by making the commercials make no sense whatsoever for their fucking car commercials. So I can guarantee you right now, before you guys had to watch this video, there was an ad for a car commercial. If there was, leave a comment down below and let me know what car commercial it was for and if it made sense whatsoever. Um, but for me, shut up phone. For me, it's like a, a thing where it's frustrating because it's, how, why is it frustrating? I, I can't really explain it to you. Just watch this car commercial and let me know what you guys think. So your folks took it pretty hard, huh? They loved that tree. It really meant a lot to them. Did you guys enjoy that? Did you guys enjoy that commercial? Did it make any sense whatsoever? No. Yeah. Well, that's basically why I'm bringing, making this video for you guys. It's one of those things where it's like, yeah, we get it, clickbait, but kind of make the commercials about, you know, a car. Kind of. I'm gonna just look through the internet and just find one commercial that is just, just their whole commercial is just focused on the car, and that's the only time when that happens is when there's dealership commercials showing you that there's a sale at a dealership you guys need to go check it out only time only time but then again it makes no like sense whatsoever or like these holiday commercials okay yeah it's so much fun there's a little kid dancing around the fucking car then he's an adult because this is something he's been dreaming about for the longest time it, it, i don't even want to get upset too much upset about this but i was watching tv the other day and I was sitting there and I was like, oh, okay, this is like a commercial for AARP or something, you know, or like, you know, someone's probably, you know, like a business company thing. I don't know. And then again, it's like a fucking Honda commercial. But then Honda, they have their two different fucking commercials. They have the Honda Helps, where you know it's a Honda commercial because they have a big ass H on their shirt. And then you have these other ones that make just no sense whatsoever. 
I get more frustrated about the ones that make no sense whatsoever, and then I just look at the ones that are like, they have the H on them, like, oh, automatically, oh, this is a car commercial, because they have a Honda, a Honda symbol on their shirt. The same thing goes for other companies, like, I'll be on the car and the radio, and there's this one company that does this weird commercial for, like, their air conditioning and, like, heating company, and they'll sit there and he'll talk about how he wanted to go and ride his bike, but, yeah, his dad had to call him in to tell him that his neighbor down the way doesn't have heat, so we have to go help him. It's, like, no fucking sense whatsoever, but the commercials, like, grab my attention. It's frustrating. That's what clickbait is. And, um, I'm not gonna make this video clickbait. Or am I? That's a good, that's a good question, that's a good question. But that's it, I kinda wanna explain to you guys that video real quick. Um, this was a really short video, by the way. Um, something I wanna do that's new is I wanna give uh, my subscribers a shout out. So I wanna give four subscribers a shout out. I wanna give a shout out to my, my good friend that subscribed to my channel that's been helping me out so much, Javier. Um, I'll leave his Instagram down below, go give him a follow and just t tell him, you know, just thank him so much for all the support he's been giving me. Um, Eric Diaz. Devonte Smith and Alexis Gonzalez, I want to give you guys big thanks, big just thank you so much for all the support you guys have been, you know, throwing my way, and I really do appreciate it. Another thing I want to do as well is that I want to start doing some contests on here. So what that consists of is that you have to be subscribed to my YouTube channel, leave a like down below on this video, also leave a comment below what your favorite car is, and you know I'll pick a random person, and you guys might win a $25 Starbucks gift card. Um, but uh, without further ado. Um, I'll see you guys. Well, no, I can't even just, I can't even leave the video yet. I haven't even do my thing. If you guys did enjoy the video, by the way, please be sure to drop a like down below. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button. <coughs> and I will see you in the next video, guys. Peace. Not this time.